Why? Because we listen to the wrong prophet. We listen to the wrong people. We, we get connected to, to wrong friends. And that's why we need the Holy Spirit. That's why we need the word of God. That's why we need to be careful that not everyone that say, Lord, 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 they are prophet of God. The Bible says that I, as I read uh, in Fiji, and a little bunger came here on a single guy, came on to run, came on me, I sang back in the wool and the money. And we taught in your name. We preach in your name. We cast out demons in your name. We perform miracles in your name. And the Lord will turn around and say, get out of me. You that commit sin. And that's why we need to know who our, our enemies. In Ephesians chapter 6, the Bible says you are not fighting against flesh and blood. You are fighting against principalities and powers and ruler of the dark world and those fallen angels from heavenly. The Bible says, "Iyan do ngaro ni kemundo binaka, may beira na pagabuli pagelaso. Er sa lago may bikemundo, may bakar sa pagisulenes, bakar bakana sipi. Iyer sa only for the ukata lamanra, only for the ukata, only for the ukata. Via chulomiko, via waseiko, via pagmabuota kiko, ferocious. And I believe that this is the time." The world is putting up a platform that any Tom, Dick, and Harry can preach. Any Tom, Dick, and Harry can say, I am a good person. I come to you. You give this. You give this. There are so many con artists in the social media today. Hallelujah. They come to villages. We were in the village in Ba. One village in Ba. Taltala. What a foolish idea. And a lot of people are caught up. Because we are not going to be able to get the money. We are not going to be able to get the money. Hallelujah. And that's why you need to be careful because the social media today. Anybody can put anything on social media. It doesn't mean that everything is correct, everything is right, or everything is the truth. There is only one truth, and that is Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. So we need to be careful to know. The Bible says you will know. You will know. And our topic today, we've been talking uh, on, uh, on Wednesday, uh, Combined Cell, on this topic, but because it's very important topic, I want to bring it on Sunday. Power in the word eight to nine. Knowing false prophet, beware of false prophet who come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are ravenous wolves. You will know them by their fruits. Do men gather grapes from thorny bushes or fig from vessel? Even so, every good tree bear good fruit, but a bad tree bears bad fruit. A good tree cannot bear bad fruit, nor can a bad tree bear good fruit. It's very clear. That's why we need to be on the dot, on the spot, and walk with the Holy Spirit. The Bible says, walk by the Holy Spirit or by the Spirit, so you don't do the lust of the flesh. Hallelujah. Fellowship. If you want to stand in the election, you have to resign from your Taltala, you have to resign from ASP, you have to resign from, from your Taltalangase, you have to resign from a HQ job. Hallelujah. They don't go together. Hallelujah. Okay, I'll put it biblically. When God, call, when God called Abram, he called him to lead. He was not a prophet. Hallelujah. That's why he came and offered his 